Hey guys, I'm Justin with 702pros.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to edit images directly on WordPress. All right, let's get started. Hey guys, so the first thing you want to do is open up a WordPress post or page somewhere where you can add your media to. And uh, once you have that open, you're going to go to Add Media up at the top left here. And we're going to go to Upload a File. All right. This is uh, a little out of what we're talking about, but um, the first thing I always do when I put an image on, I like to uh, title it and then give it alt text and a description. You can give it a, a caption. That just gives a title underneath your image. So if you're ever going to use that, just know that it'll add a title underneath the image. <clears throat> and then after you're done with that, you're going to go down to Attach Media Display at the, the bottom and you can select your alignment so left center right or none i'm just going to do left for this example and then link to um, typically i only use custom url or none custom url is if you select that you just put in the url that you want them to go to so you can make your image into a button but we're just going to select none for this one and we'll we'll make it full size so I'm going to insert that into post. Right now, you're looking at the text editor. So if you look up at the, the right side of your, your editing page, mine says text. You're probably, you might be on the visual editor, so you probably see your image right now. Um, but uh, they all work the same. I, just, I like working with the text. So I'm going to update this page once you put your image in. And then I'm going to take a look at the page, see what it looks like. All right, so I have the image that I uploaded, and it's aligned to the left, but it's full size, so it's taking up the whole screen. Right now, I, wanted, I want to work with a uh, with the editor that comes standard with WordPress. Let's take a look at that. So if I go back to the edit pa post page, I'm gonna just going to go ahead and delete this image. I can go back to edit media. If I select the picture I want to edit, so I selected it and now I'm going to go to the far right and click edit image. So this is a, a pretty basic um, image editor. It's not as extensive as Photoshop or Inkscape, but if you want to do something really quick, this is probably the best way to do it. Um, and you don't even have to leave WordPress, which is cool. Okay, so if you go to above your image on the left, this is your image. There's a few buttons here. Um, this is a rotate button, so you rotate it counterclockwise, and this is rotate clockwise. And then you have a mirror tool, so this mirrors it or flips it vertically. And this button flips it horizontally, so it'll flip your image horizontally. And if you want to undo whatever you, you did, you just click undo. In addition to these buttons, we have a there's a scale image section, so you can scale your image to whatever you want. And what's cool about this is it, it keeps the dimensions. It'll keep it in the same dimensions, so it won't stretch or skew your image at all. But this tutorial, I want to show you how to crop, because that one might be the, kind of the hardest to learn. So if you <laughs> If you look at the top left, there is a crop tool. It's this little square with a line through it. You can't use it right now. If I click it, it doesn't do anything. First, you have to select over your image, click and hold, and then drag over the image. And then this square will be your crop square. So I'm going to, once you're done with that, you release. And then you can move this to wherever you want, or you can even scale it larger or smaller by just clicking and holding one of the edges. So I'm good with this right here just for this tutorial. And then I'm going to click, now that you can see, crop is selectable. So I'm going to click crop. And now it cropped to that, that box that I had selected. Now after you're done, you have to remember to do this, is click save. And then it'll save that. All right, so now we have our new image as you can see on the right, but it still has this, all the same information. And always go to the bottom, make sure this is correct alignment. We're going to keep left. 
and then link to none. Uh, so we're going to do full size and then insert into post. All right, so now all you have to do is update that page again. All right, so I mean, that's, that's how you use the image editor in WordPress. If you have any questions, leave a comment down at the bottom of the video and um, watch out for my next video.